start with some breaking news this morning as 20 people are out of their home in Rancho Cordova after flames broke out in an apartment complex. CBS 13, Sacra Gray joining us from the scene with what we know. And, and Sacra, this is just one of two fires we're covering this morning. Yeah, good morning, guys. So we're here at the Cobblestone Apartments, and whenever it comes to fires happening at an apartment complex, the first thing these crews are keeping in mind is making sure that that fire spreads to as few of the buildings as possible. Now, this fire started between two buildings. That's what SAC Metro Fire told us. And this morning when we checked out the damage, blackened exterior of the building and smoke still hanging in the air. Now, according to SAC Metro Fire, the fire was in the small vegetation vegetation space between those two buildings. It then extended into one of the buildings into the attic space. Crews were able to stop the fire before it engulfed the building. And a good Samaritan, a resident living across the street in a home, saw the early morning flames and called 911. The flames were like popping over the roof of the of the apartment complex. This fire could have been a lot worse with the vegetation bumping into those units. Uh, this fire could have spread through the entire building, uh, really threatening the lives of, of multiple people. But the overall successful outcome with the evacuations that took place, there's no injuries reported. It was the quick thinking of that neighbor combined with the efforts from fire crews that were able to contain this fire and limit the damage here at this apartment complex. Now, the fire has been knocked down and all of the involved units were evacuated and we we're told there were no injuries and this fire is still under investigation. Now, again, as Parker Wilburn with SAC Metro Fire said, it could have been a lot worse, but for these families that were having to evacuate in the early morning hours, definitely a startling moment as they try to work to get their lives back together this morning. Now, once again, I mean, we do this weekly, but hats off to uh, the fire department. Most yeah. definitely. Yeah. yeah. All right, Sacra, thank you.